Hey guys, today uh, it's first day and I want to show my key collection. This is all I have for now. I don't really have a better place to put them than this bucket for now. I don't have the space to hang them up anywhere. So it's gonna be more of a bucket collection. <laughs> and there is a lot of different things in here, so let's just take everything out. There we go. Uh, where do we put this? Over there. Okay. So, there is a lot of keys and I really do need to sort them out a bit better, but let's just um, find all the uh, bundles first and take all of the uh, loose keys to start out with. I think that was all the bundles. So, can I tilt it a little bit forward? There we go. Here we have a bunch of loose keys because I only have one of them or whatever. Uh, for example, this is made in Germany. It's just a, what is that? I can't remember what that, that is in English, but a funny little key. And we have a multi lock key. I do have one multi lock, but I can't pick it yet. And I have this one. I don't know what that is. That's an arrow, of course, but it's just an arrow and one plus two, so I guess three. <laughs> And weird, but not bad bidding. We have cross lock key. Um, I have no idea what this is for, but it's old and it's on the table. It's old and no idea what it's for. It could be a blank for something, but I'm not sure. And what is this? Alex? Okay. Um, wafer lock key. Uh, it's actually for a mailbox. My old mailbox. Um, which is not in use anymore. Take all of these with plastic on. Here is another dimple lock key. No name on the key, but still a key. I have no idea what this is. It's just K I S. That's all it say. I have no idea what that is. We have Y W S. That's probably for some type of vehicle or something. We have a basta click. I think it's a. Uh, come on. Wafer. Uh, probably for a uh, bike lock. What does this say? Oh, it's just a copy of a key. I don't know what for. Probably for a car or something. And I have no idea what this is for, but it could be a mailbox. But it's a wafer lock anyway. Um, we have some different types of warded lock keys. There is more of them. In this bundle, we have a lot of, uh, American lock key, we have a Lockwood key, and I only have one of each in the collection so far. Um, what else? Come on, I know there is... There we go. Let's put those two over there. I have this one as well. And as far as I've been told, this is for chop, and that is quite cool. Um, I've been told about a few videos uh, where somebody shows or picks these locks and have these keys. Um, I have not checked them yet, but 
will do. Um, more water blocks. I'm not sure what that is for. Let's just fill up the hand with what I assume is water block keys. Oops. Different assortment of water lock keys of different brands, of course. All of these are unknown to me. That one don't have a brand, that one don't have a brand. That one just say K. That one don't have a brand. That don't have a brand either. That one is a Sol, I think. And I dropped the key. What is this one then? I don't know. But that's what it say. I have a Brinks key and a D key, I guess. What does it say? Come on. Come on. There we go. And we have a Dobelin or whatever. I don't know how to pronounce that. D O B E L N. That is not exactly easy. I have no idea what this key is for, um, but it looks cool. <laughs> uh, that's for a Le not lever, disc detainer. Both of these are. That's a Bliss, and that is just a cheap one, the other one. But two different sizes, I need to get a key ring on those. Then we have this one, a DME, not a bad bidding. We have a Loxinox, I've picked one of these before, and I have another one I pick for the Christmas series, I guess, if I don't get too many locks to to choose from. But from uh, well, right now I actually still need a couple of locks to have enough for the um, series, but I have a few that have said they will send, but don't know for sure yet. Let's see, we have a Metalino. I have a lock with the same brand. Uh, th that key is not from that lock, but the same brand and a Optimus. That is a no name, no name, no name, and no name, no name, and a Indag, whatever that is. Then we have a Guard Security. And a Hapo. Actually, I have a Hapo with kind of this bidding. I will try Friday tomorrow. What is this one? Hmm. Neyman, maybe? N E I M A N. I don't know. It says a lot on it, and I don't know what it's for, or where it's from. Oh wait, made in what? France? It's made in France, so it's probably from France. <laughs> um, but that's all I know. We have a... Afe. A-E-R-F-E. That's a dimple. 
and this is one of those um what is it aluminum keys so you can copy a key i don't know what it's from and i don't want to show that um that's just f maybe k f k maybe i don't know but a pretty flat bidding We have a done, which I also have a lock for, but I haven't been able to pick it. It have a, had a few keys, so I took one for the collection. Um, let's see, we have another dimple. Actually, we have two dimple keys. A cheap Chinese one, both uh, cheap Chinese ones. <laughs> this is kind of a smiley lock, but a small one. And this is just a straight key. Um, oh, we also have whatever this is. BKS. Pretty nasty bidding. Six pins and what looks like three side pins. Uh, oh, that's a Yale. I have some Yales over there, so we take that later. This is just, I like the head on this key, the uh, shape and all that, but it's just a cheap Chinese key. What is this one? Ronis, uh, probably made in France, I guess. And that's a wafer lock. And this is another no name, but a <laughs> fun bidding. Actually, this would be perfect for a bump key. <laughs> Um, let's see if anyone likes euro cylinders here we have a euro locks key for a wafer lock um, PJ I don't know this brand um Guard. Hey, I had another guard. I have to put this aside and remember that. I can just as well sort them out while doing this. This is a G key, which I also have a lock for. And look at that bidding. It's pretty much just flat, uh, totally flat. It only have a small curve. Um, and this say W. B right there. I don't know if you can see that. It's made in England. Quite flat bidding. Then we have what is this? Another Euro lock. So I actually have to put this aside as well. Take a few more keys up here. I don't know if you can see it. I think you can. This is a Illinois key. Never heard of a lock with that brand. Come on. There we go. It took some time, but we did get bidding. And I can't read that. Nothing on that side. Pretty nice bidding. This is just straight up A. <laughs> on one side and the other side says... I can't even read that. I can't read it. It's something with A, L and then BIRD. Okay, come on. Then we have a cheap key, Milaco. Nah. This is just a RS key, not so big, flat bedding. This is a Batu. 
Yeah, well, it's made in Spain. We have a Coben Roswin. One, two, three, four, five, six pins. Nice bidding. I have a lock that it fits to. Oh, we have another fun key and another um, ward key. This is just a no name, but a fun, nice cut there. And then we have Mifa. This should be for a mailbox. What does this say? Reaper, I think. R I P A. Ah, it's easier to see there. It's made in Spain. Again, very flat, just one cut. Not many key, uh, loose keys left, guys. This is just a cool key. I like these spikes. Oh, the other way. As you can see right there, it have started to break, and I ha it was um, I had to uh, straighten it because it was um, yeah the key was not straight when I got it, but uh, that was already starting. So I didn't make it worse though, but I did manage to make it kind of good straight, and the bidding is not too bad. But I would love to see what that is for. What is this? Uh, I can't read it. Maybe you guys can. It's actually easier through the camera, but I still can't see it. It's easier through camera than it is with, just with my eyes. Another Mefa. So I also have two of those. Okay, I have to put that aside. What is this? JMA. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe a six pinner. Not bad. We have an Asa key, and on the other side, it, it's a Sab. I don't know why, but it's a six pinner. So nice key. Another Yale. Put that over there. This. Oh, I had the other one was also this brand. It is Alibird. I thought so. A L L I B E R T. So I have to put that aside as well. Nice to get them sorted out. Another one of these Neyman. And this is made in Germany, so I also have to put that aside. And is that O or D M E? I think it's O M E. That is quite nice bidding. And this is a no name, but it's an old key. Doesn't say anything on the other side either. Um, this is old, and I can't read a single thing. I can see there is some writing on it, but I can't read it. There is some numbers down there and some letters up there, but I can't read it. And the last key is my own name, oh, well, a part of my first name, and Nico, which I have said to a bunch of you that you can just call me that if you don't want to call me Lockmania. So that was all the loose keys, then I have some bundles, so this video is already kind of long, but we are so far in it, so we can just as well finish it. Setcon keys, as it's a right there, Setcon. This is a Vison version, and um, uh, Vison is the brand, it's a version of the Setcon, and this is a Enbout. So two different of those. We have some Apis keys. I have a Wafer Lock Apis key, and then a bunch of other Apis keys. In different sizes, and this is an old one. Uh, 
Um, these are two slider keys, two different. One of them, by the way, is one guard, on guard, and the other one is just a cheap one. Here is Berg and Berg Vector keys. That's a long one. If I can get that damn key ring on there. That is a Berg. That is a Berg. And that is another Berg Vector. Then we have Yales. There we have them. Wait. No, oh, they are not the same, but they are close. Let me just quickly put this on. So we have some Yales. That say something on the key, that doesn't. And then we have from uh, some of the newer key, uh, newer locks there, and then another Yale key here. Uh, Caesar keys. And they don't look the same as you can see there. They are not the same. And the bidding. Actually, the bidding is kind of. Actually, the bidding is the same, but the keys are not. Then we have some Viro keys. Three of them, two small, one big. Not much on the other side, except that this kind of blank just made in Italy. Haven't tried a Viro yet though. Take all of these small bundles. Okay, what do we have here? That's a genie made in, in England. There is whatever that is and a board it. These are actually from Chinese locks, but they are some cool keys. They are not really the same keys, but the lock is kind of the same. The bidding is, of course, not. And castle, I guess this is, yes. One of them is a lever, and the other is a pin tumbler. What is this? That's Union. Yay. There is some warded, and there is some... Uh, that could actually be wafer, but I don't think it is. And that is definitely pin tumbler. What is this, then? That's Packlock. A 100 and a 150G, both from Sterilock. Yes, save. Small and big. Uh, trains. That is for my 30mm padlock I have, so I guess that is for 20 or 25mm. Um, this, I guess, is for Bosch. I think, I think that it is, but not sure. And Kato, C-A-T-O, it's actually easier to see on this one. And the bidding is almost the same. Okay, three more bundles, guys. Let's take the Ruko keys. I have a Ruko lever key. And a old Ruko Jr. I have shown this before, I think. And two 500s. This is the uh, newer one, and that is the older one. You can see that on the uh, R, the K, and the O, and then on that little edge right there. The edge is missing there, and the R, K, and O is not as pretty as on the old key. Uh, we have a key from a Ruko Garant, that is a Ruko 600 key, and a Ruko System of the uh, six pinners. 
which are not in use, any of them. Uh, we have a bunch of... Um, lever keys, um, Rex for one, and I have two of those. I have a, I know this is for handcuffs, but um, it is sort of a lever. There is some different lever padlock keys, and that is a cool one. Love that one. Um, then there is. Some no names and stuff, so there's a bunch of lever keys, and then I have for the end a bunch of car keys. Well, it's still keys. I have Peugeot, Opel, Fiat, Yamaha, Volkswagen, Citroën. I don't know what that is. Uh, Rover. I don't know what that is either, and Ford, and don't know what that is, but look at this cool old Ford key. And then that Yamaha key. I don't have a Yamaha, I don't actually have any of these vehicles, but look at these cool Volkswagen keys. So... That's all the keys in my collection, guys. That was a long video, and I usually don't do that. But I did have the time, and I wanted to do this, so... Yes, now I'm uh, onto that, and every time I get some keys, I can always show them in the video. So they don't get backed up like this again. Alright, guys. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Remember, skill always beats luck, and have a great day.